steak is amazing, but the sauce. Yeah, the sauce is so good. It's like not too sweet, but it's the right amount of umami. Mm -hmm. I don't like it when it's too sweet, but I also don't like it when it's too, like, Mm -hmm. okay. um, if you guys can get your hands on that umami seasoning, please do because it really does make a difference. Wow, well, now I can make steak at home. Yeah. Hello everyone, welcome back to Angie's Tables. Today I'm gonna teach you guys how to make a really delicious meal if you have seen it in the thumbnails. But it's steak over rice, and in Japan you can call something like this, anything over rice, kind of like a tonburi, but still a little different because in tonburis, the meat is usually simmered in the sauce, but today we are not doing that because I like when my steak is medium rare to medium, but I feel like if I just simmer it in the sauce, it's just gonna become medium well, or like super well done. And I don't want that. We're gonna cook steak and simmer that. Sorry, Ella's right over here, so it might be a little loud. We are going to simmer some onions into this really umami, flavorful, and delicious sauce. It's gonna tie in the rice and the meat together, and I feel like it's fairly easy for you to make during your busy weeks. It not only looks appetizing, but it tastes so good. I can't wait to show you guys how to make this. Let's go check out these. To begin with, I made rice in a pot enough for two bowls of rice. So I just have that in the back, I started making it. And next we're gonna make the sauce by combining the sauce ingredients, which includes soy sauce, water, some mirin, and a little bit of sugar. And we're gonna set this aside. We are gonna be using our Nakano knife because this cuts so well and I've been loving this knife. If you guys have not checked this product out, we do have it in our link tree, which is in our about section of our channel. Let's slice up a half an onion and chop up two green onions. The green onion will serve as garnish at the end to really elevate the dish with that pop of green color. Make sure with steak that you pat all the blood off. With the steak seasoning, you can do whatever you want to it, to be honest. The thing Gino likes to put on a steak is umami seasoning from Trader Joe's. It's gonna bring it, but once again, I forgot. Do you have it? I, oh, you have it. I didn't I need it. Wow, we are gonna use this. Okay, so this is what it is. Let's cook the steak on high heat. Cook to your desired doneness. So medium rare is about three minutes on each side. And then once we do that, we're gonna wrap this up in foil and set it aside. Do you guys know what it's time for? Today's word of the day is nongsa, which means to farm or farming. And these days, okay, I am so far from being a farmer. I'm actually really bad at it, but I love to see my plants grow. The only thing I hate these days with my planter box and all that is the weed that grows on it because I don't have the weed coverings over it, which I probably should, but it's just so tedious and I have to do it every single year and I don't have that much that I'm growing. I mean, to be honest, my parents came and planted everything for me. I just give it water and I make sure it's growing well. I feel like sometimes we take it for granted. We go to a grocery store, like, okay, a potato, okay, an onion. But each potato, each onion, there was so much time and effort. Me growing things at home made me realize that. So that's why I can't throw food out because I know how much effort went into growing each and every produce. That's why I feel like I cook so much more is because I don't want to throw out food. I mean, number one, it's a waste of money, but you're also wasting the efforts of all the farmers. So anyways, today's word of the day is nungsa, which means to farm or farming. In the same pan that you cook the steak, combine the sliced onions and the sauce, and we're gonna simmer this for about three more minutes. Then 
Then we're going to use a small strainer to strain the sauce out of the onion. And set each of these aside. Wow, there's a lot of setting aside today. That smells amazing. I feel like our channel is really good to just scroll through and figure out what you want to make for dinner. I mean, obviously there are more difficult level cooking that does happen on the channel, but I feel like for the most part, I try to make it easy so that you guys can actually try it out at home. For instance, Grace said this week she's going to make the Japanese spaghetti and she's also making Big Mac tacos. Oh, bang bang chicken. Oh, and bang bang chicken, which wasn't on our YouTube videos, but it is on our shorts. I hope that I am of some help to you guys who are trying to figure out what to eat during busy weeks. In a bowl, we're gonna add rice and then top it off with the onion. Then we'll add steak so it's surrounding the bowl of rice, showcasing the slices of it. Let's add the sauce all over the rice bowl. In the middle, we're going to top it off with chopped green onions. I'm gonna squeeze on a little bit of wasabi. You can mix it and enjoy it, or you can grab a little bit of rice, add some wasabi and steak and scallions on top with the onions, and enjoy it that way. Oh my God, this looks amazing. Oh, oh so I love eating now too. Ready? Huh? Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. The wasabi, man. You need the wasabi. If you like wasabi, if you like it, it. Yeah, it's so good. Were you gonna show them? Yeah. It's worthy of another. Oh. <laughs> the sauce is amazing. It's like not too sweet, but it's the right amount of umami. Mm -hmm. And then I think it's a good idea because like mm. steak can get expensive. Oh, but you can get one steak you for the both of you? Yeah. That's true. If you guys can get your hands on that umami seasoning, please do because it really does make a difference. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna continue chewing. The steak is a little bit more chewy. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and make this Please, it is so delicious for anyone at, okay, not any age, but for everyone. I feel like it's kind of hard to not like this unless you don't eat meat. But we'll see you guys on our next video.